Ahead of the UN Summit of the Future, young people from around the world were asked for their perspectives on what this gathering can represent. Here are their thoughts. I hope that in the next hundred years we learn how to have more spaces, like to see each other. Then we're able to um, kind of be in each other's shoes. A world where everyone has equal chances. You would not have people thinking about themselves and it would be more looking at how can I help everybody else around me. I don't think that right now the systems of the world um, they are serving the purpose that they should be. We want peace in the world. We want peace in the world. We can't have unity without justice. And hopefully in the future, what you'll start to see is this shared identity amongst groups. We're going to start realizing, wait, we're all in this together. So every human being is created noble. Inside, we're all the same. We all want good. We all want better men of the world. Right now, there's a lot of a lot of things happening in the world, and even though a lot of it isn't positive, I think that kind of creates a lot of opportunity to do positive things. And we've tried to discover identity by saying, oh, I'm separate from this group, or I'm separate from this person, but I don't think that's working for us. I don't know how the culture came up, but uh, as most communities started believing that uh, someone has to come and save you, like someone from outside has to come and rescue you. So for you, there's nothing really you can do to sh change your situation. So some sort of inspiration was removed from our hearts. We really need a change at the level of hearts. And we need to actually instead be focused on like what is the best for all of society, not just one demographic. We're trying to build to a world that's united and that has peace it requires us redefining what it means to be a leader. The leaders of the world have the responsibility to hold these values of service and kindness and love and justice, so many different values, because the people that are following them will emulate that. True leadership means service to humanity. That's, that is what the world needs right now. I think what's needed is a shared vision. That means everyone's on the same wavelength. Each and every one of us has a role to play in the betterment of the world. We just need to understand that we can do it together and we really need to count on each other. The earth is but one country and mankind is citizen. I would like to believe that. And I'm 101% sure that that is what everyone wants to experience.